Hi everyone, Dave Jones with Sig Sauer Federal Military Sales. Uh, proud to be here today with Tactical Distributors to discuss our ILP program that they've just recently signed on board with. Um, this program is for our military and law enforcement professionals, either retired or on active duty. And uh, Tactical Distributors is going to be one of our uh, IOP dealers in the Tidewater area that will be able to provide this to our military and law enforcement and first responders. Um, pretty much if you're carrying a weapon on duty or in the military, uh, many of these weapons are provided by Sig Sauer um, as well as a variety of other weapons, but a large portion of our inventory is offered through this IOP program. Some of them are all on the shelves, similar to what the Navy SEAL teams are using, what DEA, Secret Service, um, and many of our local state and police agencies are carrying currently. Whether it's from a 226 um, or 227 like Indiana State Police or the Mark 25 that the current SEAL team community is carrying, those are available through the IOP program. Um, some of our rifles as well, depending on what you're looking for, semi-automatic, bolt gun, uh, sniper rifles, um, AR platforms, whether it's gas impingement or gas push rod systems, those systems are available as well. Some of the benefits of the LP program to the, uh, to the end user, you're getting the same gun that a professional, either military or law enforcement person would use or that you're actually using on duty. That weapon's coming in its hard case, it's coming with three magazines, just like you would get a standard issue. Um, it also comes with a lock. Um, your discount, your uh, structure from your MSRP, you're looking um, probably a 20 to 25 percent savings off of retail and this is SIG's way to give back to the service member and first responder. If you have any questions or need further information on the SIG Sauer IOP program, you can contact Tactical Distributors and they will take care of any questions or needs that you may have.